Alex with windowcleaner.com. Today I'm going to show you how to winterize your system. Whether it's winter time, you know you're not going to use it for three, four, five months, or you just need to put something in your RO membrane to protect it from sitting for a long time. RO membranes are the most expensive filter on your system, and they are kind of the most fragile in a sense that they can build up algae, they can get clogged, and then they're no good. So I'm going to show you what to do with winter approaching, or if you just are not going to use your system for a couple of months, you got to put it in storage. I'm going to show you what to do to make your filter and the RO membrane last as long as possible. In preparation for this video, I did let the system drain as much as possible. I took off the top clamp on the RO housing, pried open the RO cap. Just so you know, you do need a kind of a Phillips head or a long something to give you a little bit of leverage to get this cap off. It is double overing and it really is stuck on there pretty good. So you're going to discard your pre-filter. These are very inexpensive. Buy a new one come spring. And the same goes for the resin inside your DI cartridge. We're going to take this out, dump the resin in the garbage, put it back in and seal it back up. Old DI resin in the garbage, empty cartridge back in. Okay, so the pure water line on the system goes back to this closed DI cartridge, no problem. But the waste line, you can either put a brass cap on the bottom or I have a little hose with a shutoff valve on there. So the water will stay inside the RO membrane. And what we're gonna do is mix this RO Guardian into just about a gallon of water. If your system is going to freeze over the winter, you can use RV antifreeze in the RO membrane in place of water but it's not gonna freeze in here this winter. We're just not gonna use it for a couple of months. So we're just using water. We're gonna mix the RO Guardian in with the water and then we're gonna pour it directly onto the RO membrane. Gonna use my multi-tool to stir it. And let this dissolve in the water. Okay. And this is why you want to cap the system, plug it up in some way so this water with the protectant doesn't just flow right through. And then we're gonna slowly add it to the membrane. And this is going to inhibit bacteria growth and keep the membrane good while it sits inactive. There's a lot of space in a membrane to fill up, so you do have to do it slowly. All right, that's an entire gallon mixed with the RO Guardian. Let it settle. And then we're gonna put the cap back on. Put the clamp back on. You just do it hand tight. And now your water fed system is ready for winter storage. Again, if you're gonna use this or store it somewhere that it's cold. Use RV antifreeze in place of water. If not, just use a gallon of water, mix that RO Guardian in there, and you're good to go until spring. If you bought a Zero system, you will have received RO Guardian with it. If you've already used it, you need more, or you can't find it, head over to windowcleaner.com and look for RO Guardian.